Hi and welcome to the Wiki Procedure Info channel. In this video, we'll see how to transfer name for water connection in Ladakh. The link I'm highlighting on screen is also provided in the description below the video. Please click on that link to reach this page. Once you reach the page, there's a select language tab in the top left corner. You can click on it and you can select whichever language that you're comfortable in to view this procedure in that language. Over here you can see all these links. These are the links to the various section of this page. So each section will provide you with important information required for successful name transfer for water connection. The first section is the procedure section. Over here you can see that for uh, transfer of name of water connection in Kerala the applicant has to approach the irrigation and flood control department or the public health engineering department or the municipal committee office. We have provided the contact link to all these offices over here and also in the office location and contact section we have provided the address and more contact links so once you click on these contact links you will be taken to a new web page where more contact details are provided so with the help of these contact numbers you can get in touch with the officers beforehand to know about their available timings and plan your visit accordingly and then um, before visiting the office, you need to prepare certain documents which are, we have listed in the required documents section. So, these documents you need to have on hand before visiting the office. You need to have the ownership certificate, the sale deed, the latest tax paid received, the latest paid bill of water charges with no due and an affidavit in the stamp paper of required value attested by a notary public and an attested copy of succession certificate and NOC from the co-owner and also you need to submit an address and ID proof of yourself. For that you can use your Aadhaar card, your driving license, your ration card, voter ID or your PAN card. All these documents you need to have photocopies of them in order to attach them to the application form and also it is best to carry the originals with you while visiting the office because sometimes the authorities might ask for the original for cross verification purpose so once you reach the nearest municipal committee office you can get the application form by paying the prescribed application form fee once you get the application form please fill in all the details and attach the photocopies that i mentioned earlier and submit it to the concerned authority once you submit it uh, the authority will check whether all the documents are in place and then they will request a processing fee you need once you pay the processing fee you will receive an acknowledgement which you can use for future reference after that uh, some site verifications will be done by the authority and after that verification the authorities will make the necessary changes in the computer record before the next billing cycle. That brings us to the end of the procedure. Thank you very much for visiting Wiki Procedure Info channel. If you found this video useful, please click on the subscribe button to find more such useful videos. Thank you.